Hello, Minions, Munchmo, back with more Kerbal Space Program. And you'll see in front of us a space plane? Don't know exactly. This is actually something that I challenged the boy to do. With having zero experience with Kerbal Space Program whatsoever, I wanted him to try his hand at building a space plane to compare with how I am able to do it here. Now, let's take a look. We got Noonie Kernan in the cockpit. And we're going to see how this thing flies. Now, he's got an episode he's thrown together and everything. Uh, so, don't forget to head on over to his channel. Check that out. But, uh, let's see how he did. He had 30 minutes total. Got a couple test flights, put it together, all that sort of stuff. Personally, I don't think I would have gone with this design. But, you know what? That's okay. Let's, I mean, look at this. It's already rolling. How interesting. But anyway, we're just going to hit that button. And see what this thing can do. Um, seems a little unstable. That's okay. Or maybe not unstable exactly, but uh, unusual. I'm I'm pulling up, and it's not going up. I'm I'm trying to pull up. It's not letting go of the runway, and I'm afraid of. Oh no! Up. Oh, 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 okay. I, he was able to fly this thing. So, uh, maybe, maybe, maybe I'm just not as good at flying airplanes as he is. I don't know. But we're back on the launch pad here. Let's try this again. This time I've got a uh, caps lock on for more, um, more fine control. Um, he's pushing buttons on my... SAS. It's SAS on. He was trying to do that. Oh, that 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 totally just made everything worse by doing that. I don't, I don't know what happened there. Let's let's try that again. <laughs> this is awesome. Oh, okay. Let's see what happens here. Um, let's try that again, shall we? Let's turn that SAS on. That's what he's suggesting. Throttle up, not quite as much. Maybe that's part of the problem too. And oh my God, as soon it's it's it's. Why? I'm so confused. It changed our heading immediately. Maybe if we try to take off... No, no, no! Oh my god, I don't... <laughs> I can't fly his blade, but he can fly it! He got that thing up in the air! So let me show you what I've done here. I was just kind of playing around with some testing, and we're going to go ahead and uh, revert to the space playing hangar. I don't know how he was able to get that thing going, but we're going to take his idea and put it together with my idea, and see what happens here. So let me show you what I put together. Just, just testing. Call it the tester. This one doesn't have a pilot. It's a unmanned craft. It's just something simple, just to play with aerodynamics and stuff. Actually, hold on. Before we go there, I want to look back at his upper goer and see exactly how he designed it when relation to uh, stuff. So there's his center of mass, way in the back, and there's the center of lift, way in the front. So okay. All right. I just wanted to take a look at that, and let's take a look at my tester here. Same thing, we're going to look at center of mass, center of lift. Center of mass, about the middle. Center of lift, just a little bit behind it. Honestly, I think that if we move the center of lift more close to the actual center of mass, that's where I think I like it. We'll see. Um, but let's, let's launch this one, and I'll show you what this thing can do. Uh, I, I don't know exactly how good it is. Oh, I moved the wings. I don't think I should have moved the wings because I knew it worked the way it was before. But with the wings moved, it might not work. Oh, I did a bad thing with the way I moved the wings too. Oh, well, hopefully this will work. Actually, that might work okay. So let's just go ahead and throttle all the way up. Hit that. Turn that SAS on even though it's not going to do anything. Well, I mean, it'll do something here. This one's just a simple little jet. See, and we pull up. I said we pull up. I think moving the wings is a bad idea. I said pull up. Holy crap, we're going really, 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 really fast and we're not going up. I'm pulling up and nothing's happening because of the way I moved the wings. It's because of the way I moved the wings. I shouldn't have moved the wings. 300. Oh, there we go. To the end of the run. Oh, oh God. Oh God. I shouldn't have moved the wings. It's so not good with the wings the way they are. I accidentally, I meant them to go straight, not at an angle like that. I think that kind of messed me up a little bit here. Yeah, okay, let's revert that back and f 
fix that so I can show you how this thing's actually supposed to work. And then we'll get to the meat of the episode of designing a new plane. Let's just load the tester back up and launch it as it is. There. Launch it like that, with the flat wings, the way they're supposed to be. Although the center of lift is a little bit behind the center of mass, but that's okay. I couldn't fly his, but he could fly it, so, you know, whatever works. So here we go. Throttle up all the way. Get us some speed. Get that speed up, and now watch. We'll actually take off without going all the way to the end of the runway. So how's that? That's the way I intended it to be. We didn't even have to get that far on the runway, and this thing's fairly maneuverable. Ooh. Whoa, yeah, buddy. See, it works. It's got a lot of lift. It can move pretty good. I even landed this thing. Let's see if I can do that. Actually, you know what? Let's not see if we can do that. Let's just kill it here, and let's see what we can do about designing the new craft with his ideas and my ideas combined. Well, I'm going to take what I think his ideas were <laughs> um, and see what we can do about that. So, the first thing I want to do, obviously, we need to get a cockpit in here. And let's go ahead and throw in our fuel. We want a couple of these 400s, the big things here for fuel. And let's, let's stick three in there. That was his original idea. Three of them, right? And then we go here to our aerodynamic. Let's take one of these wing connectors. Shall we? Like this. What does... Oh, wait. We need we need more than... We need two wing connectors there like that. Right? Okay. What do these things even do for us? Do they give us lift? They must give us lift. Right? Oh, yeah. They give us lift. Wow. That one thing gives us lift. So what we're going to do... We're actually going to move them back here like this. That angle. Right? And do they... Do they actually... I don't know how they work in relation to giving us, um, like, fuel? Okay, how do I do this here? Do I go, like, so? Okay, cool. Now let's go back to our aerodynamics. And this one, let's see what we get. Point two. Point two intake area. The intake area is tiny on this thing. That's weird. Hold on. Mass. They're the same thing. Why would I want one over the other? Not your average air intake. These high performance intake pre compressors to supercharge air breathing engines. So this gives an air intake as point two. And this is the same thing. So one looks I don't. Because <laughs> one looks cooler is what I've been told. So let's go with the cooler looking one, shall we? <laughs> And while we're at it, let's see. What is radial engine body? Actually, let's look at these things here. This one, actually, this one just... I don't even know what this thing's meant to do. This one's an intake. This one... I don't know what the hell this thing is. I don't know. Anyway, so let's go and throw another couple of these wing connectors on here. Like this. And some more tanks. See, unfortunately, the boy is not as familiar with the parts in this game as I am, so he didn't quite know what to look for. Okay, let's stick these guys here. Now let's give these things some good engines. Where am I going? Over here, propulsion. I'm going with turbojets, because they look much cooler. Okay, so that's pretty neat, isn't it? I like that. So now we need to give it a little bit of a tail fin, right? Actually, hold on. Let's look at our lift and our mass here. Our lift is there. Our mass is there. Let's, um... Let's add some... F Ooh. Maybe if we go, like... Just one of these. Not two of those. One of these things. I don't even know... Why I might want this, but... Let's do it. Okay, there's that. And now let's give it tail fin back here. That's not quite angled right. Please and thank you. 
Oh, it needs to go forward a little bit here. Like that. Oh, that's good. That's good. I like that. Now let's give it a uh, control surface here. If I can figure out. These control surfaces are a little weird. Trying to get them to actually line up and match up where you want them. Like that. Hopefully that's right. Okay, good. Next up, we need some small control surfaces. Actually, you know what we need? We need a big wing. A big wing to move the... Uh... We need two big wings. Like this. So let's... Put them like that. Actually, let's get them straight on here. Like that. And let's... Uh... Give them some control surfaces as well, but we'll give them big old control. Oh wait, will this even work with these? I don't know. I don't know if these will work with that. So no, let's, let's throw some small ones back here then instead. Rotate these suckers. There we go. Those don't quite look right. I guess that's right. Okay. I hope these are right. We'll see if they are or not. Oh, wow. I didn't realize that control surfaces gave lift. Seems that they do. Because it's moving our center of lift back. Actually, that's okay. That means we can move these things forward where I wanted them to begin with. Okay. That helps a little bit. Ooh, that's cool. Okay, so let's... um. Throw these guys back here. If I could figure out how to do this. There we go, like that. Holy crap, that gives so much extra lift there. I don't... Huh, I'm not even sure what to do with this thing anymore. If we take these guys off, it just moves that way. So what if we put these things... What if we rotate them like that? So that's how people make that happen. That's <laughs> okay. I'll take it. I don't know if that's quite what I wanted, but it'll do. It'll do. Um, maybe, maybe if we move these forward, but it won't look like an X wing, will it? Here, here. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna move this back, back. I say back. that I really want to get these things lined up just right so maybe if we do it like so and like so there we go oh the angle on this one is totally wrong so let's try that again come on get it right is that right that's better. Okay, that's much better. Now we need to do some work on our propulsion here. Like this, because all these tanks are going to be feeding from here. I don't know whether or not it actually feeds through the, um, the whatchamacallit or not. Honestly, I'm not really sure. And last but not least, now we have to worry about our, um... Movement stuff here are so let's see if we can get that going. Okay, we want one landing gear here. Like that. Oh that why why is that all the way back there? I didn't want that back there. I want it up here. Is that in the right spot? And that's centered. Okay, that's good. Let's turn these two things off. And now we have to do some here how will this look I don't know if this is gonna work very well give us a really funky angle on the plane what do we got that we can use for structure ability here anything worthwhile small hard point maybe that'll oops 
Maybe the small hard point? What does this thing do for me exactly? I don't know. I don't even know what the heck this thing is, but let's try it and see what happens here. If we can get this thing to work for our wheels. I, I'm really not sure what this thing even is. What the heck is a small hard point? Anybody? Yeah, I don't think this is going to do it. Whatever the hell this thing is. Yeah, no. Goodbye, hard point. I'm unsure of what that's for. So I guess... Let's see. How are we doing for... We got a long modular girder segment. We can kind of... No, that ain't going to do it. Huh. You know, I'm just going to have to... Going to have to wing it somehow here. So let's throw down this wheel again. Right here like it's supposed to be. Like that. Okay, good. And that's not quite enough to get this going. So... Hmm. I'm not liking what I'm seeing here. This is making... Oh, wait. What about if we do this? Hold on. What am I doing exactly here? don't think that's going to work. But wouldn't it be awesome if it did? Let's see what happens if we try these guys instead. <laughs> Why not, right? I really don't think these... Oops, I need two of them, not one. I don't think those are going to work. <laughs> Give it a little bit. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, if only there were an easier way to do this. I guess I'm just going to have to go with these guys and uh, have a weird... No, that's not... that won't work for me, though. Just do what I did. The extra <laughs> oh, he's suggesting I do what he did. It, and and I'll, I'll, I'll try his, his thought here. Only I'm going to use a fuel tank instead. Because why the heck not? Is that centered... Uh, I don't know. What if we... Ooh. Oh, that wouldn't work very well. Actually, that might work okay. Let's, um... If I have that part... Do I have a two? I only have the one. And the three... That actually might work okay, and then we can throw a couple little thingies in there. Huh, how about that? Let's throw down just some, a couple little fuel tanks here. This is probably going to kill the aerodynamics of this. But you know what? It's just a game. It doesn't have real aerodynamics. Ha <laughs> ha! And that actually gets us about the same level too. Okay, that might work. That, oh, we don't need science for this thing to... No science. We're just playing with airplanes. Darn it. Put that there, like that. Should probably throw down some... Uh, two to one to four. Oh, that's not going to work. Crap. That could be a problem. Hmm... Okay, let's remove these guys. And Sorry, I accidentally clicked outside the window. What do we got here? We've got some fuselages, which don't... Oh, they actually hold fuel. Standard fuselage... It's... Huh. Oh, wow. We could be using... Jet fuel instead. What? Uh, I guess I'll have to worry about that later. For now... We're just going to throw down a couple of structural fuselages like he suggests. Why won't it let me do that? I'm going to have to do this one at a time. What am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, like he's like there. No, one. I have to choose the part. That's my problem. There we go. There. Okay. And let's strut them together a bit. Just to make sure that they hold. 
And now we will add our wheels, plural, because we have space for wheels. Um, what is it doing here? Oh my god, it's treating each one of these, oh, as one. So we're gonna have to put these on singly. That's gonna be kind of annoying. Is that good? Yeah, they're good enough, why not? And then we'll go down here and throw, you know what, hold on, let's move this plane forward. No! Undo, undo! Control Z! Control Z isn't working, why, 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 why didn't I save it? Why didn't I save it? Let's put that back and then Control Z. There it goes, whew! Okay, let's save that real quick. Upper goer 9002 with the funky cases too. That's even better. Yes, there we go. Okay. Whew. I thought I lost all that work. So let's throw these suckers here. Let's throw these suckers here like, like that. All right. Let's see how this thing goes. I have my doubt. I have my doubts. And who's flying with us today? It's going to be Noonie once again. So let's launch this thing and see how she does. Let's see how she does. I'm scared. Come on, Noonie. We don't have the rapiers. So this is more just playing with space planes than anything. Oh my god, we're like... Yeah, that's not going to work so well. Let's, um... Let's fix the wheels in the back real quick. That's not quite good enough. We can do this though. Somehow, magically. All right, you guys need to... <sighs> the problem is it's like they need to be I don't know what to do with these wheels. Maybe like that? <laughs> That's a horrible design, but let's see if she works. Here we go. Here we go. Please be... Oh. Oh, so far so good. Let's throttle up. And let's see how she does. Let's see how she does. Let's go ahead and uh, turn our SAS on, even though it won't do much for us, I don't think. And let's try to pull up. Try to pull up. We're not pulling up very well. Let's turn. Oh, up, up. No, 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 no. No, that didn't work. You know what we need? We need more lift. We need more lift! Oh boy. I think that's I think that the change in design messed with it a little bit here or something. I but I think we need more lift. So let's just add more wings and see what happens here, shall we? So let's start with some of these things. We need sets of two. Back actually let's do it like that. Woohoo! Like that, right? And then let's set some structural wings back here, like so. And here, like so. So kind of cool. And um, let's give ourselves some more Delta Deluxe winglets here. Actually, let's see if we can move them back here-ish. Well, you know what? Actually, that might be okay. Let's let's take these guys. Let's take these guys and scoot them back, actually, to move our center of lift right about there. There we go. Maybe that'll do. Okay, let's save that and try that one. When in doubt, add more wings. <laughs> right? <sighs> it's probably a little too heavy and not enough lift is what it boils down to. If only there were an easy way to swap out 
the uh, fuselages that I have here for the other kinds of fuselages. All right, let's try this again, Noonie. Will we take off this time? That is the question. That is the question. All right. We got some speed. Let's try to take off. I'm not even... These things are not... I'm confused. Whoa, okay, we're going to fall apart here. Those control surfaces that I have on there aren't reacting to anything, so I don't think they're working right. I don't think they're working right, and that might be part of our problem. I think they're stuck. So let's see if we can fix that. Where did they go? Where did they go? Okay, we have the small control surfaces. Maybe if I put them... See, that they, they're weird. I don't even know how to make them work right. Eh? Do we have bigger control surfaces? We do, don't we? And these are, these are too big. I don't even have any wings that are that big. Maybe... Maybe it's because of the... Here, let's try it. Ooh, maybe that's part of what it is. It's because... Those things are at a funky angle, right? Right? Maybe that's what it is? Come on, can I... I don't know how these things are supposed to go. Maybe that's what I needed to do. Control surfaces are funky. I have a control surface on the tail. That one looks right, doesn't it? All right, let's try it again now with changing control surfaces. Let's look at our stuff. Oh, wow, our center of lift is totally changed because of those things. Huh. Maybe we need some winglets back here. Like that. And let's see, do we have a... Uh... These have active control. And these are... Provide high lift and stable center of gravity. Oh, these are big guys. We can stick a couple back here in the backpack. Like that. Ooh, wow. Oh, yeah, this thing's getting really slick now. And these things can get, uh... Oh, here we go. This is what you're supposed to be doing. Oh, yeah. Now this, this, this. Let's save this thing and let's see how she does now. Maybe now it'll finally take off. I don't know, though. <laughs> oh, boy. If this don't work, I don't know what will. Because, I mean, I made one little plane that worked, didn't I? The boy made a plane that worked, but the complicatedness of the planes make things harder. Now we have a ton of lift, right? We have a ton of speed, so we should be able to just... Pull up, pull up. Those control surfaces are working. They were working, darn it. Okay, hold on. They were working, but they weren't working well enough. We do, we just don't have the lift for this is the problem. <sighs> we just don't have the lift. We have too much weight, which sucks because the only way to fix that is by replacing all of the things with these things. So that's what I'm going to do off camera. Be right back. All right. I've made a few modifications to it, along with the switching out of fuel and oxidizer for the jet fuel fuselage stuff. So we'll see how this works. Um, I got more wings. It seems much less structurally stable, st stable, stable because of this whatever going on there. But uh, let's. Uh, oh crap! I forgot to take these things out and replace them with fuselage. Oh well, whatever. Let's just see if it works, shall we? I have a feeling that it won't, but I'm hopeful. Got a lot of extra lift. It's very... crazy, really. We got some speed. Can we take off? Can we take off? Please? Okay, let's turn the caps lock on just a little bit. Maybe we have to hit the end of the runway to take off. Oh, we lost a part of the plane because we hit something. 
Oh my god. If only we hadn't hit that thing, we actually would have taken off. Because we took off! So that's one weird thing about this. It's like, if you don't do the space planes quite right, they will screw you. And you won't be able to take off until you get to the end of the runway. But once you get to the end of the runway, you're fine and you're in the air and everything. It just has to be that whole you gotta get off the ground thing. Okay, let's get ourselves... Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh my god, it's... It's so unstable. How could I not fly this thing? I don't know. I'm really bad with space planes, it seems. Something really small and simple, I can do. Something big and complex, I can't make happen. All right. Let's throttle up a little bit, not a lot. Maybe that's part of my problem, too. Too much power. Like, this thing, it just has liquid fuel. This has oxidizer, too, which we don't need the oxidizer. So that's the other problem. Throttle down a little bit. We don't need to go super fast. We need to be able to control ourselves on the runway so we don't hit stuff. Once we're lined up, no, 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 no. Oh my god, it's it's too wobbly. It's just too wobbly. I can't do it. I can't do it. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. You got any suggestions for space planes? Because I you saw me, I put together one that worked. Maybe I need to... You know what? Let's try this. Let's see what happens if I do this here. Or no, other way. Like that. And another one. Like that. And yeah, I don't think that's going to make a difference. I don't think that's going to work. Maybe if I put some nose cones on the back of this thing. I don't know what these things even do for me, really. What do they do? Does it even say? It just says tail connector. Aerodynamic tail fit on all standard attachments, but it would, let's fly line of parts. Okay, whatever. I, I have no idea what I'm doing wrong. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So, uh, can we set this to symmetry too? Um, that didn't work. Um, I don't know why it's doing that. Actually, here, if we do symmetry 2 and we start from up here to there. There we go. That's more like it. I don't know if that'll help, though. Let's look at our things again. Maybe we just need more wings. We need even more wings. Do we need more wings? I really don't know. I don't know. But there you go, space planes are really hard. Really friggin' hard. And uh, that's really all that I got for you today, guys. We're gonna try this one more time. See if we can't keep this sucker under control a little bit. This is it, this is our last takeoff. I don't think it's going to work. I think it, it is partially because we're just structurally unstable in the middle. I think that's what it boils down to. We're just going to taxi straight on and hope not if we can't uh, keep going straight down the runway, make it off the end, maybe. See, I do this and we're just... There's just too much weight in the front, I think. We need the... That... I think the center of lift needs to be... I don't know. I, 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 there, There is a specific place where it shouldn't be compared to the rest of the machine. Here we go. Oh, they crap, we're in the air. We had to go to the end of the runway and we're, we're, we're lifting. We're lifting. Oh my god, it works! <laughs> Not nearly as nice and maneuverable as the little guy. But hey, there you go. I just had to be patient. Yeah, space planes are not for me, man. These things are too tough. Too tough! Don't worry, I'll play around with them more, maybe. But for now, you know what? Let's see what we can do about getting our butts over here. See if maybe we can land or something. Onto the island there that's got the uh, abandoned 
thing. Oh, look at yeah, look at how wobbly it is as we adjust and stuff. It's like that's that's the problem. It yeah, there's your problem. It's too wobbly. I totally borked it up. That that's that's the whole big problem with the whole thing. It's too bendy, too wobbly. But I'm in the air. Question is, can I land it without destroying myself? I don't know, but we did it. We did it. Hey, I took his idea, added my own tweaks. Totally borked it up a lot, but eventually made it out. Oh my god. It's so bouncy. Should it be wobbling in the air like that as we fly? No, no it shouldn't. But we're, we're moving. We're not even flying the direction we should be flying. Let's turn off SAS and see. Oh my god, don't turn off SAS. Don't ever turn off SAS while flying. Actually, what happens if you do? I just want to see what happens. No, we, we, yeah, oh. We start flying up. Yeah, let's not do that. Let's see if we can't get down. Whoa. Hold on to them. Apples. Coming in hot. No. No, Noonie. Spin. So there's a lot of uh, uh, runway over there. I don't know if we can line up with it or not. I'm hoping we can. Let's see what we can do here about heading this way. We got a lot of fuel. So that's a good thing, right? We even have oxidizer for absolutely no reason whatsoever. Whoa, you gotta rotate. Gotta rotate. Gotta go this way. Gotta line up with that runway. We're totally gonna crash. Ooh. How would you like to ride in a plane like this, huh? We actually put some crew cabins down here. Maybe that's what we needed. Let's carry extra crew. Be able to make a jetliner. <laughs> Okay, we gotta pull up a little bit. Let's see if we can line up with this here runway. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. I think it's supposed to just be on the uh Whoa, 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 whoa. Get back, get back, get back this way. Come on. We need to line up with this thing. Come on. Can we do this? Can we do this? Well, we went too far. We went too far. Slow her down. Slow her down a little bit here. Going way too fast. Going way too fast. Come on, down. Down. Slow it down even more. Come on. Come on. Down we go. Slow it down even more. Holy crap. Are we gonna do this? Are we gonna do this? Let's level out. No, no, you gotta, you gotta down, 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 down. Oh my god. X. Whoa, whoa, hit the brakes, hit the brakes, hit the brakes. No, Noonie! We almost made it. <laughs> oh, well there you go. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye.